Merry Meet, everyone. I'm going to be doing a reading for Singing Fan, and they've asked me regarding a yes or no question regarding school and if they should postpone it or if they should start in January. So I'm going to do a yes or no spread with the Fairy Tale Tarot deck and see what the cards have to say. Shuffled enough. Uh, let's see. I'm going to be using number six, the number of harmony, for this reading. So let's see. And the question was if she should or he should, I'm sorry, postpone the um, the classes. So let's see. Okay, so I'm getting a definite resounding yes. We have all six cards upright. We don't have one reversal. So it's saying you should postpone them um, until the fall. That's what the cards are indicating here. So let's see what they have to say regarding your question. The first card we got is the Two of Wands regarding your question. Looks like you've been through a lot. Um, there is some financial struggles you're going through right now. Um, as you can see, this is the Billy Goat's Gruff Fairy Tale. This one I haven't read either, but you could see that this person here is kind of upset about some things that are coming through. And you see the, the, the goat kind of attacking him. So it looks like you've been through a lot. There is some situations that have to do with your job that um, you can't really commit to right now. Um, and in the sense of not not letting go of your work right now. You can't do it um, right now because of your financial circumstance. And this card is telling me that you should wait um, and just look at other options right now. Um, it's not saying to let it go. It's saying to postpone it for until the fall um, because you have other um, situations that you need to attend right now that are priority at this moment. So that's center to the issue. The next card that's crossing it is the Chariot, the Snow Queen. This is a beautiful card because this card is saying that things are going to progress and are going to evolve. They're saying that you shouldn't worry about not being able to go back to school. It's going to happen. Eventually, you're going to get there. Month of the July looks like a very indicative month for you to continue pursuing that idea. It's going to be a perfect time then. Right now, the card is saying that in as crossing, it's saying that you should just wait a little bit, but that everything's going to go forward as you want because the chariot is always a card about progress, a card about moving, moving forward. And the colors in this card are beautiful. They're all blue. Um, and there are other, other plans you have in the winter as well that you want to take advantage of. Um, I don't know what it is, but it looks very pro promising. I don't know if it's with doing with your work, have to do with your work, or if it has to do um, with any other thing, maybe a vacation, maybe, I don't know, it's something that you're looking forward to in the winter, and if you go to school, you can't do that. So this card is saying that you're going to go ahead and continue with your efforts of going to school. It's going to look very prosperous, but right now it isn't the best time to pursue that. At your feet, we have the Six of Cups, Hansel, and Gretel. Love this tale. This is telling us this tale is about two brothers and sisters, okay, um, who go through many, many obstacles. Many obstacles, many challenges. 
they placed their trust on the wrong people, and there was a witch that wanted to eat them. They, their parent, their dad, kind of was married with their stepmother, was you know married to to their their stepmother, and basically the woman fooled them, and so the father didn't care about that, and they they were basically left without home. Um, they went through so many challenges, and they were in so many danger. But at the end, they were well protected, and they got to the end with prosperity. So it looks like you're going through a lot of obstacles right now, a lot of opposition, a lot of situations that are with a lot of struggles in your life right now. But at the end, you're going to be very happy with the results in regarding school. It looks like you're, you're, you're facing a lot of situations right now, even with family and friends, that have you a little bit sad right now. Um, but they're saying that you're going to come out with victory at the end with the results. Okay? So this is a very beautiful card to have underneath you. Recent past, we have the temperance. This is the water and salt fairy tale. I haven't read this one. But this one is a card of peace. Okay? And this is a beautiful lady here who is bringing to the king, a, you know, like this, this chalice and uh, like an offering. And you see other people looking at them. And you seem like you're the king. You're the one that's sitting here. And you receive, you've been praying for guidance, a lot of guidance. You've been very confused lately about many things, especially having to do with school and your career path. And... Even And it's due to all these challenges that you've gone through, okay, that you've been very kind of confused about things. And you have received a lot of guidance, especially a woman, okay. I don't know if you're, you're, in, you're into Wicca and you pray to the goddess, or if you, but there's a female de deity that is listening to your prayers and is helping you through this process, okay. And she is guiding you to the right direction. That's what this card is saying. Future, regarding school, we have the Ace of Coins. Again, this is a card of abundance and new beginnings. And it's saying that everything's going to go as you plan and as you want. A new beginning coming here. And here we have this person praying about a situation. And, you know, offering something here to, to their deity. And it looks like you have, um, you're going to be starting this that you want. But it looks like you're going to wait a little bit. Okay going to come out with prosperity at the end. This card in the future is the King of Swords, and this is you flying here in the future, relaxed, very happy with the outcome of things, and things moving along perfectly fine. So this card is telling me that you're going to move for, for perfectly fine, that things are going to evolve, and that you're going to be happy with, with the result of having to postpone it, because you have to handle other things right now. But that is what the cards say for you regarding the question. I hope I was able to help you with this situation, and um, let me know if you have any other questions. I am so sorry it took a while to give you the response to the reading. It was I had so many other people that were waiting as well. Let me know if you have any questions, any concerns, um, but definitely the cards are saying to wait and to postpone it until the fall because it will be much better for you. So that's the conclusion of the reading. Many blessings to you.